Hey guys, this is Nick from BonBonsai.com and today I am talking about the Cypress Bonsai. So, let's get some information on the Cypress Bonsai. The word Bonsai is most closely associated by mo uh, mostly with the growing of miniature trees and although this is somewhat accurate, there is much more to it than that. A Bonsai is not a genetically dwarfed plant, but rather one that you keep small through proper planning and maintenance. Of course, I've already discussed how bonsai, bonsai, bonsai is pretty much tray planting. That's what it is. That's what it means. Two kanji to it. The right combination of pot confinement and crown, uh, and crown and root pruning is essential here. And any tree or shrub, as long as you offer the right training and care, could become a bonsai over time, although there are certain plants that are more sought after than others. There are more, uh, sorry, there are many different styles of bonsai that you can choose from, and one of the most popular of all is the cypress bonsai. So the cypress bonsai has right characteristics for trimming. The cypress bonsai is a type of bonsai that is available in either formal upright style or slant style. I've already covered these styles. You can go and check out my videos and or my articles at bonsai.com about the styles. The formal upright bonsai style comes just as the name suggests and is characterized by a straight, upright, tapering trunk. Although the trunk and branches of this cypress tree uh, may incorporate certain bends and curves. So uh, the actual apex of this style is always located directly over the roots. In regard to the slant style of the cypress bonsai, this tree is similar to the formal upright style, only the trunk emerges from the soil at an angle rather than straight up and the apex of this bonsai will extend to the left or right of the root base. Now, Care and maintenance of bonsai. The care and maintenance of bonsai is crucial to its growing success and there are certain things that are critical to remember in order to take proper care of your bonsai. For one, a bonsai prefers the morning sun with protection from the afternoon sun, especially in the summertime. If your bonsai is placed against a wall, you want to make sure that you turn it around every two weeks or so because if you do not do this, the tree may end up growing out of shape because it will tend to grow towards the light. Correct watering is one of the most important aspects of all and most trees need more water in summer than they do in winter. Basically, the more leaves your tree has, the more water it will need and you become familiar with your own bonsai, uh, so you'll be able to tell by the weight of the pot uh, and to determine how much watering is required. That's all for this video. Now, if you want to learn how to sculpt, prune, trim, repot, wire, all that stuff, your bonsai, then make sure you go to bonbonsai.com forward slash bonsai book, and you'll see what's in the book. Now, you won't get to see the book, but you'll... It tells you what's in it. tells you more about the book. So I'm making more videos like this. I've made plenty of videos like this. And uh, when it comes to advice, tips, information, things like that regarding bonsai. So make sure you subscribe for more content. And I'll see you in the next one.